Hi there, Reed, and yeah, congratulations on your beautiful performance um, in the Thank film. You. I just wondered what, what it means to you to be sharing Jaden and Joe's story with the world, with, um, with the film Joe Bell. You know, I think for me, it's, it's really, it's an honor to get to be a part of this story in any capacity. So the fact that I'm getting to be a part of and, and tell the world about Jaden's legacy and just how kind he was and what a light he was is something that I, I don't know if any other project will ever top that um, in terms of the honor that I feel that I get to do it. And I get to tell the story with the people that I get to. And I know that you met Jaden's mother and that you also wore um, some of Jaden's own clothes um, in the yeah. film, I believe. And I just wonder what it was like to you know play a real person. And also if there was anything in particular that made you feel like you um, were sort of authentically portraying him or that helped you to do that. Yeah, you know, it, there was a really weird moment um, of clarity and of like, okay, this is where I'm supposed to be. When I was doing my first fitting and I was trying on his clothes and they fit pretty much perfectly. And it was just this weird moment where everyone in the room got really quiet. And like, you know, with, the, with a film like this, when telling this story, emotions are high. Like people are really feeling it. And I feel like if people weren't feeling it, they wouldn't be a good fit for this. And so feeling that just gave me more confidence in telling his story. And, and also knowing that I can, and I've said this a lot, is I, I think it would be disrespectful for me to sit here and say, I get it when I don't get it. I can never understand anyone else's experience other than my own. So for me, it was all about finding that connection between the two of us, between me and Jaden and what we had in common and knowing that I do know what it's like to be alone. I know what it's like to feel isolated. I get what it's like to grow up in a small town that doesn't get you. But also having that respect of Jaden lived those experiences that I can't even assume anything about. So I need to learn everything about him and take from my own experiences to as best and authentically and honestly portray his story the way he would want it. Tragically, suicide rates among LGBTQ plus youth are disproportionately far higher than um, their straight um, and cis contemporaries. And I just wondered what impact you hope this film might have as it goes out into the world. You know, I think for me, it's the fight for equality um, and inclusion and acceptance is such an important one and, 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 and in loving each other and accepting each other. And I hope this movie, not to sound whatever, but I do hope it's a brutal wake up call for the people who have turned a blind eye to that fight. And I hope it's also a call to people who, to know that it's, it's a two way street of, of the people who need to change, need to see this and know that they need to change, but also it's, some people who don't allow those people to change. So I hope it's able to unify everyone and to know that we all have things to work on. We all, we're all people, we're all in this boat together. And it is just so important to do our absolute and very best to understand each other. More importantly, be kind to each other and love one another. Well, Reed Miller, thanks very much. Very powerful film. I've watched it twice and cried twice. <laughs> well, I'm, I'm glad you liked it. Thank you so much.